good morning students welcome back to our english class in today's class let us learn the last lesson of our textbook honeycomb lesson 10 the story of cricket by ramachandra gruha despite a busy schedule one has to take time to devote for sports when we question anyone which sport or game they would choose undoubtedly they would say cricket the craze for the game is such as there are more icons in indian cricket that people look up to and follow can you guess any cricketers yeah sachin dhoni virat rishabh pant sehwag rohit sharma the list is endless and there are many names to mention and drive inspiration to yes i hope you agree with me but in the present scenario cricket has become so popular that people get glued to tv to watch cricket a material of the age 6 or 60 and it even doesn't matter whether the match is a 50 over match or a 2020 match so in today's class let us learn the origin history rules equipment modern cricket and use of technology so please open textbook page 139 the story of cricket part 1 by ramachandra guha cricket was played in england about 500 years ago it a uh, hit as evolved with time it became distinct by the 17th century means a bit more popular and by the middle of the 18th century bats were similar to hockey sticks that means they were curved outwards and why were they curved outwards was at the bottom they were curved and why were they curved was that gave a chance to the batsman to contact the ball means to have a touch with the ball now playing cricket match for 5 days that is a test match okay and they played a match for 5 days but what happened ultimately it ended in a draw and that makes it different from various other games like beat a football match uh, any guesses how much time does a football match uh, completes in it almost takes about an hour and a half and a baseball match which is of a limited match of 9 innings uh, takes less than half time that is taken to complete a limited over match of modern cricket very unique isn't it now let's come to another curious uh, curious characteristic of cricket to be noted the length of the pitch in a cricket ground must be 22 yards i'm talking about the pitch of the uh, cricket mat uh, ground okay now here irrespective of the shape or size of the ground so the cricket ground shape might be oval shaped like the adelaide oval stadium in australia or it may be the shape of a circle or a circular stadium like the chipok stadium in chennai however the special dimensions of the playing area is laid in other team sports like hockey and football so they have a specific dimensions it should not exceed uh, immaterial of whether it is a, a a team sport like football or hockey now the next one we can check with the laws of cricket there were certain laws framed we'll see what are those laws and these laws were written or framed in the year 1744 in the 17th century after that many changes took place now here they were they were stating that two empires uh, present in the ground shall decide all the disputes maybe that means they are the final decision makers and the stumps must be 
22 inches high and the ball to be of 6 inches. And there should be two sets of stumps should be placed and the distance between them should be 22 uh, yards distance should be there. And the size of the ball must be, be between 5 to 6 ounces. Yes, there it's given a 163 grams. And next, there were clubs formed. And the world's first cricket club was formed in Hambledon in the 1760s. And the Merleybone uh, Cricket Club, that is MCC, was founded in 1787. And did you know there was variation in bowling too? Usually, uh, I mean, in the initial uh, way of playing cricket, they used to roll the ball and the batsman used to hit. And the variation was what started. There was the spin and the sp swing. I hope you know more better than me re uh, anything related to cricket. Due to which the curved bat was replaced with the straight one. You can see the transformation of the cricket bat in, uh, in the picture of the slide over there. Was replaced with the straight one and the width of the bat was fixed to 4 inches. So the bat uh, width should be 4 inches and the weight of the ball also was fixed. How much the weight of the ball should be? It should be around 5 and a half to uh, uh, 5, uh, 3 fourth ounces. And in 1774, there were still some more uh, changes like the major matches, which was earlier 5 days. Now it was fixed to 3 days. And the creation of the 6 seam uh, cricket ball was also witnessed in this loss during that year. Yes, I hope you are able to understand. Let's go to the next one. Now here it comes to the game equipment. Now cricket changed along with the changing times, but the originality was intact. Where it was actually uh, started? It started in England, isn't it? So maybe it was changing. But the originality, did, they did not miss the originality. Now you might ask me, what is this uh, originality? Earlier, the bat was made of uh, either leather, twine and cob. And slightly over time, the blade of the bat uh, was, uh, is made of willow and the handle was made out of cane. Even today, both bat and ball are handmade. They are not industrially manufactured. A very nice point to be noted. And they were not even using man-made materials like plastic, fiberglass and metal. These were firmly rejected. Yes. Now let's uh, come to the um, invention or of the protective equipment used by the batsmen. You can see the changes. Uh, when it was the earlier uh, uh, cricket play, uh, being played by uh, batsmen and present uh, more modern cricket. Now, the equipment was like pads, gloves and later helmets. Earlier there were no helmets, but now in modern cricket, it is compulsory for the batsmen to wear a helmet, which is which was made of, uh, uh, which is made of, a metal or a synthetic or a lightweight uh, materials and we can easily see or we can say that there was a lot of influence of the technological change yes children so when I mean I can say that uh, cricket is a favorite of every child in general there's nobody uh, who, could, who will say that, no, I don't like to play cricket or I don't like to watch cricket. Yes. In today's class, we learned history, origin, rules and equipment of cricket. In the next class, we will be discussing about modern cricket and the use of technology. That's all for today's class. Thank you.